Hello and greetings and salutations everyone, it is I, Flip the Bacon, and welcome back to my channel for all my returning subscribers, and if this is your first time checking out Flip the Bacon, well, I hope you enjoy what you see here. So today, we're continuing on for our blind let's play of the pre-alpha demo of Battle Princess Madeline. Now, like, us super shot guys, like, there's a lot more to this demo than I thought was going to be in it. I believe we have to find one more hidden level in the game and then five more, uh, artifacts for the treasure room. So we're back. I'm just getting back in here. Uh, we're going to go <laughs> talk to the town villagers. We just save a little boy and one of the little hidden areas. And before I guess I get too far ahead of myself, I would like to say thank you to Casual Bit Games for giving me permission to cover this blind, or their blind let's play, or cover, excuse me, their pre-alpha demo of um, Battle Princess Madeline. So yeah, we're back in here. We're going to go see what they have to say since I saved the little boy. Um, let's see. That cousin of yours is always unlocking old gates, uh, looking for loot. We already saved him. Um, I think this is probably going to say the same thing. Hello, Madeline. Did you know that? There are... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, I believe over here we saved the little boy. Maybe this she'll tell us about it here. Let's see, you found him. Please take this. Thank you, Maddie. Ah, look at that. So that means we got four more statue things to find. And, uh... Let's see. Hey there. Yep, 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 yep. So when you gotta do things to the statues, you gotta... By the way, you gotta hold down at them. And just wait for a little bit and it'll drop the item. I believe. That's how it works. That's why. That's how I've got my stuff to work here. Um, we're gonna stick with the, the lance this time, though. I would like to see more about this. And I think the last uh, place that we're looking for, the last hidden level, just kind of judging by these little circles on the ground, is probably in the last area over here. I don't know if it'll be here, per se, the stage three of the flooded royal crypts, or if it's going to be up in here. I'm willing to say that's probably going to be up in the, this part. So, well, I hope that we'll find it in here anyway. We'll see what happens. I think it's in here, but... Oh, no, it would definitely not be in here because this is the boss. So let's go ahead and return to the map here. And uh, we'll go down into the other place. It has to be in this part then. So let's see if we can find this hidden other level in the game. And by the way, we switched it back over to... Um, we switch the game here back into uh, non uh, lines on the screen, and we are um, playing with the orchestra music again. Orchestra. Ostr I can't even say that word, so you have to par pardon me. Orchestra? Yeah. So we got to see if we can find. Uh, let's see what. I think we already got the thing up there, but let's go ahead and check because I just discovered a new hidden area. Nope. We have not, I don't think, come across this. We'll see what she got here. It's an axe guy. So that should leave us with three more hidden uh, things to find in there. So. Nothing here. Oh, where did that guy come from? Do you notice him? Did he fall down from the top here? And on the last level there, we also found, uh, last time we were playing this, if you guys saw, we found a really cool um, part to the game. I was like, wow, that's super duper awesome. Ah, maybe this will be it. No, here's a gate, ominous gate here. So maybe we'll find something there. Um, did we go this way last time? I don't know if we did or not. But uh, let's see if we can kill this guy if, if anything comes from it. And let's see if we can get this thing down. It doesn't look like we're hitting it this time. So let's just go ahead and head back up, I guess. This looked like it would be something, like a hidden thing would be here. Um, but yep, yeah, nothing there, I guess. 
We'll be back here maybe eventually. Um, so let's head back up and go this other way. Ah, we found another hidden up thing up over there. Ah. Hmm, that's a pretty scary jump there. Uh, maybe we'll take the plunge uh, here in a second. After we see what's up in this general area. I wonder if this is a, a chest that we already found earlier. Oh, no, it's not. Definitely. We found the battle axe. Cool. Um, yeah, that's some good stuff here. Oh, okay. Look at that. It made a bridge. Hmm. Did it make a bridge below, too? Oh, gosh. And we're eating. And uh, we gotta be careful. We're running out of life pretty quick here. Maybe if we drop right here. Nope, it doesn't let us drop down through here on the bridge. I am definitely curious to still see if there's something over there. All right, guys, we're back here. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. Also just got killed by a skeleton here. Okay, so we found the other secret key in the it's in the second level here it's right in the beginning of the game i can't believe i missed it last time so if you go through here and uh i can't believe look there's a statue right here and we're gonna pray to it and this is where we get the second key at so yeah look at that we got the second key and now we gotta go find the next area and uh i'm pretty excited about this this video is gonna be pretty long I think this will be the end of our Princess Madeline uh, blind let's play. I think we'll find everything at this point in time in the game. Um, I don't think we're going to come across anything else. Um, let's go down here. I think this is where uh, the next treasure is potentially. Oh, man. We got nailed. Um, where did we see the gates? Um, maybe the gate was over here some more. So this will be leading us to the next secret area. Here we go! Look at that! We found the, the next secret area in the game. I'm super excited about this. Oh, look at this! We got Def here. What is Def going to give us today? Oh, what is that? Oh, look at that! It's like the fairy weapon from Super Ghosts and Ghouls. Uh, the fairy weapon, if you didn't know, was how... Uh, was it the fairy ring or the fairy... Um... Fairy ring, I think is what it was, a bracelet or something like that. Anyway, that's what the weapon you need to beat the final boss and uh, Super Ghosts and Ghouls with. Oh, man. We got some crazy jumps here. So we're in another cave. And um, I'm going to probably go back to the other screen. Yeah, we're going back in there for sure. I'm pretty excited about this. Oh, no. And we fell right into the spikes. Um, you know what, guys? I have a feeling this is going to be a long video. So, you know what we're going to do? Unfortunately, we are going to wrap it up right now. But you guys can stay tuned. I'll have produced two videos. Um, they'll both be out tomorrow uh, or today, technically. But, yeah, um, like I always say at the end of every single one of my videos. Wait, 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 wait. Like I always do before the end of every one of my videos. I like to say thank you very much to everyone. Um, the Kickstarter for Battle Princess Madeline got fully funded and it hit its uh, stretch goals twice. So they only got two more stretch goals. This game is on fire. I think they have $100,000 and $150,000. Yeah, $150,000, uh, two stretch goals. They are really up there. They're doing really good. I would also like to stand a thank you to all the, the casual bit uh, uh, games. Um, you know, their workers there, they've been really helpful, and, and they definitely now I reached out to them, talked to them, and they talked back to me. They were, these guys are seriously good people. Uh, they're definitely out to help you, and, um, well, they help me. You know, I feel like they're doing a really good job. They're really serious about this game. Again, if you guys want to, like, there'll be a link over here. Please, please, uh, 
spend some money towards a Kickstarter if you haven't already. And let's get this sucker fully funded. I would like to see this stretch goals just blown away, which I think it will for this game. But all right, guys, as I always say at the end of every single one of my videos, flip that bacon. See you next time and goodbye. Goodbye, everyone.